Now there is actually two of them inside of gallery I wanna share, and one of them is moving your search down here. So rather than it being an icon on the top right-hand side, which Samsung One UI is meant to be used with one hand and making everything easy, just put the search on the bottom. It doesn't need to be in the very top where you have to reach for it, and it gives you a full entire um, tab. So in this way, you can take a look at everything. So it's an easier way for you to look at all of your videos. Uh, it could also be an easier way for you to take a look at any of the gifts that you have created or that you have. If you want to take a look at all of your pro videos, uh, all of your motion photos. So when you go through, you can actually bring the search down. And then the other thing that I want to share with you, which I'll just show them both now, and then I'll turn them off and show you what it used to look like. Go inside of your menu and you have your private album. And then inside a private album, you know, this is used with either your face or fingerprint or pen or whatever. And this is where you can put in some images if you would like to have them into a private folder. So you wouldn't have to, you know, put them into like a secure folder of your device. So how you're able to unlock both of those is you go right inside of your menu, then you go into settings. Once inside of settings, you're gonna scroll down and you'll take a look at about gallery. And this is where you tap on that version number like seven times. I'm pretty sure it's the number right there, the, the version number. Now that has been unlocked, it's right there in the very bottom and you have gallery labs. You can even have album entry locks. So if there's an album that you would like to have a lock or a code for, you can do that right there. Now in order for you to move anything over to your private folder, let's say we just wanna move over this picture, you press and hold on it, you go to more, you just move it to the private album and that is it. If I go right back inside of it, you'll have this icon there which is just restore it back to internal storage. And then now when I go back to my internal storage, it is added and it's just sitting right there. 